Hi everyone, we're at Madex 2023 in Busan, South Korea. We are with Subseacraft, a British company. Lee Evesworth, good morning. Good morning. You are the commercial director at Subseacraft. Can you please first tell us about the company? Subseacraft is an advanced maritime technology company and we privately fund R&D projects to innovate technology that we think can solve challenges in the military and commercial sectors. One of your uh, key products currently under development is Victor. Can you tell us more? Yes, uh, Victor is getting a lot of interest at the moment. It was a vision within the company to enable military forces to conduct force projection and covert operations with ease. This was the result from the design. It's a blend of two capabilities, a fast surface craft and a covert subsurface swimmer delivery vehicle. We've ended up with this concept, which is currently configured with two pilots to deliver six operators and payload into access restricted, access denied areas. On the surface, it does 250 nautical miles at about 30 to 40 knots. It can then transition from surface to subsurface where it operates for 25 nautical miles at sprint speeds up to eight knots. The unique element about this craft though is the digital control system. So every element is controlled by a single source, which means that we can automate the, uh, the craft functions. So the complex challenge of going from surface to subsurface is done by the pilot and a single push of a button. You are here in uh, Madex in Busan, South Korea, showcasing Victor. Uh, do you trust there's any uh, requirement for such systems here in the country? So there's two requirements at the moment that are of interest. There is the submersible assault boat concept and there is ghost. Submersible assault boat is essentially a craft like this that can deliver divers and Ghost is an uncrewed variant. Because of our control system, this single platform caters to both programs. So although we are currently in trials for the manned variant, we also are developing the autonomous control system for the same platform. So Victor will be able to do crewed and uncrewed operations in the future. And it's all about that flexibility for militaries being able to deploy forward in a number of um, operational configurations. All right, Lee, thank you very much. Thank you very much.